YouTube video. Um, I guess 2020 has been a very strange year for a number of different reasons and I feel like honestly doing something like this isn't too much of a far cry. Um, don't know who I am. My name is Mel. I am a third year uni student currently completing my Bachelor of Nutrition Science um, as well as completing my Cert for in personal training. Um, I'm a coach for Evolve Performance Method also known as EPM. I honestly have no idea what direction I'm going to take this in but my passions are nutrition, fitness and body positivity so I guess you can expect to see uh, videos on those sort of topics from me. So today, unless you've been living under a rock, we'd all know that um, we're currently in lockdown, at least Victoria is, stage three or four. I don't really know. I just kind of do what I'm told. Yeah, so we're pretty much homebound at the moment. So I just thought I'd take you along on sort of what a day in isolation, or not isolation, but lockdown looks like for me. Um, most of the time I am doing uni work or I'm studying my Cert 4 um, or I'm doing work for EPM or I'm um, experimenting with baking and things like that. So obviously a day at a desk is going to be so boring to watch so I thought I would do all the more fun sort of things today. But yeah, we'll pretty much just see where the day takes us. What you saw this morning is a pretty standard morning routine for me. Um, I like to have my breakfast a bit later in the morning because um, it's the luxury of being home all the time, I guess. Um, and also because I like to have a full bottle of water before I have my first meal of the day um, to promote good digestion and to be more intuitive with my eating. I am starving, so I'm going to jump into the kitchen and go ahead and make myself breakfast. So I'll show you what it is I'm making. So for breakfast, I'm going to be making chocolate protein oats. So I'm just taking half a cup of quick oats and adding that to the pot on a medium to low heat. And I've got half a cup of oat milk as well as half a cup of water. And I'm just adding a fraction of that at the moment um, and stirring that through. So I'm just going to stir that consistently for a couple of minutes till it starts to thicken. And then once it gets a bit thicker, I'll add the rest of the water to make, um, to make it a bit looser for the protein powder. So I'm adding one scoop of the 180 Nutrition Chocolate Protein Powder as well as one teaspoon of the Organic Hemp Plus just to make it extra chocolatey. Once it's at desired consistency, I'm just plating that up. My favourite toppings are peanut butter as well as some banana. And then finished off with some chia seeds. Super simple and it takes me five minutes tops. Okay, so that's breaky all done. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and do some work at my computer for a little bit. So obviously that's a bit boring to watch. So I will check in with you later. <laughs> So I've just jumped outside to film some exercise videos, one for the EPM Instagram page um, and another one for something exciting with 180 Nutrition, which um, actually that'll be out by the time you guys probably see this. So it's going to be a giveaway. Um, so make sure you enter that one. So I just thought I'd get out and film this today while the sun's still out because it's meant to be raining for the rest of the week. Give me all you got. Okay, so 
so now that that's all done I may as well do a workout out here while everything's out so I'll take you through something that's dumbbell only um, it can be done in your bedroom even um, and it's yeah really, really good yeah I'll just get set up for that a good one I'm absolutely pooped now I feel like the key to really good home workouts is really short rest periods so my rest periods just then were literally 30 seconds um, when I first started um, working out from home when the gyms closed I was doing my normal rest periods of like a minute and a half to two minutes and I just found it like really way too easy yeah definitely decreasing your rest periods makes the biggest difference just keeps your heart rate up fatigues your muscles so much more and that's a very simple workout that you can do with literally just a dumbbell um, this is pretty much the most amount of equipment that I have, which I'm so lucky to have these. I'd go crazy without them, to be honest. Resistance weight training is just my favorite. I'm not a cardio person at all. I'm really not a fan. So doing the front squats, that really works your core because you're holding the weight in front of you. So it really works your core to hold yourself upright. Bulgarian split squats are always hard, no matter what you're doing. And then the donkey kicks at the end. So. I ended up doing them without a weight because I was just so fatigued. You'll probably see in the video how much I'm shaking by the end. Um, but the key to um, um, kickbacks or donkey kicks, however you want to think of them, is you want to keep them really slow and controlled. It's really easy to start swinging your leg and using momentum like that. It doesn't really work your muscle as efficiently as you could be. Um, so yeah, definitely um, focusing on doing it slowly, contracting through the back of your leg and your glute when you're lifting it up, give you a nice squeeze at the top and then releasing it back down. Um, you'll get a much better, um, you'll get much better glute activation doing it that way. So pack all this away and go and make a late lunch, I think. Oh gosh, first we've got to clean this. Lunch, I'm just going to be doing a scrambled egg on some avocado toast. So I'm just taking the egg and whisking that one up. And then I just push it around the frying pan until it's nice and scrambled. Then I'm just um, adding the avocado to the whole toast and adding the scrambled. 
record egg on top. And that's pretty much all there is to it. So this vlogging thing isn't off to a great start. <laughs> I thought I broke the camera all afternoon, so yeah, that was an uncomfortable couple of hours. Turns out I just pressed the wrong button, dude. Don't f*** up the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Are you bad? this video up here thank you so so much for watching i really really appreciate it um if you did enjoy watching this video make sure you give it a like and subscribe if you would like and i'll speak to you soon <laughs>